Hey, in this video, I'm gonna show you just how to service your tile blow off valve and even change the spring if you want to, all wrapped up in this video. Let's get started. application in your car, sometimes you need to upgrade or downgrade the spring that's in your tile blow off valve. Now right here is the tile Q that I currently run on my 2008 N54 335i. Uh, pump gas run around 17 psi, race gas that tries to target 20 psi. So uh, the internal spring is fine for what I have. I have the 11 psi spring and now, now this is off vacuum pressure, not off boost pressure. So a little difference there. So since it is a new unit that I've been using for about a couple months now, I want to go ahead and show you guys how to disassemble it. And I'm gonna check the piston. I'm gonna just ensure that I do have the yellow spring in there, the 11 psi one. And I'm gonna put some additional grease in there just to make sure that piston's moving freely in there because let's face it, a lot of these will just sit on the shelf. No fault to anybody, they just sit on the shelf and sometimes the piston can get just stuck or doesn't move as freely as it really should. But it's a very simple process to go ahead and do so. So go over here to my workbench, we'll get this started. So to open up your top blow found, you just need a T25 Torx or you can use an Allen key, whichever. Uh, that you want to do, you can go ahead and do so. We'll use an Allen key for when we break it loose here. So equal sides, since it's under pressure, we'll do this one right here, and we'll do this one by the USA here. Go. Outside popped up. There you go. Just like that. There's your yellow spring. This is the 11 PSI spring. So that one seemed, so mine seemed a little stuck. So this is where we're gonna grease it up a little bit to make sure it's moving freely. So here's where you can change out the spring if you wanna go to a stiffer spring, uh, to, a, uh, to a 12 PSI spring, or if you want to go down from the 11 PSI to a 10, to an eight, to a six kind of spring. This is how you would change it out, just swap out the spring. Put the new, uh, put the top back on. Put all, put everything. Put all your T25s back in, and that would be it. So we'll go ahead and grease this up here, this piston. Make sure we'll grease all through here. Just make sure when it's operating, it's sliding perfectly through there. So this is grease specifically for diverter valves, blow off valves. It's very light. Apply some right here. This is like right where the piston comes down at. So I'm gonna take the piston completely out. All the way around, looking good. We'll go ahead and put this back in. Just 
spring will sit just right in there. Since it is sitting right there, I'll go ahead and grease the bottom. Now, it's ready to be assembled back again. Now that we have everything ready to go, now is the fun part of compressing the spring down and getting these all tied on here. Ugh. So you're gonna go through, make sure it's all completely tightened. Then you're gonna make sure it's completely tightened. Just some tight turns on here. And there you go. Now you can change your spring or even just service it or even just to make sure that it's not fully stuck being a brand new part. Uh, so this has a, that 11 PSI spring in here. That's gonna be a really tight spring um, to be able to compress just sitting here just easily like this. But it's very simple, of course, to change it out. Now then you'll want to go ahead and attach it to your charge pipe. This is for the N54 um, or whatever application that you currently have. All right, guys, well, that concludes the DIY for today. Hope you guys found this video definitely informative. If you need to change out your spring or service your tile blow off valve, this little easy guide will help you along the way. A big thumbs up on this DIY video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and check out my other informational videos, other DIY videos surrounding the BMW N54 but E90 chassis in general. Thanks everyone and hope you have a great weekend. Take care.